All right. Certainly a bit open-ended as far as our next steps. So that's why I'm kind of looking around for places. The last game, they had the series of uh, beacons of survivors to kind of nudge you in the direction to go. Well, that's deep, dark, and spooky, so we're not going that direction. All Terra supply cash nearby. Ooh. Emergency supply cash. All right. See if we can make it over there. Want to make sure we don't accidentally end up under an iceberg and drowning. I find drowning to be a suboptimal choice. You know, I, I don't know about y'all, but I prefer not drowning if I had the choice. Ooh. Oh, is this the cash? I see. Ooh, a first aid kit. I actually did need that. Um, we are going to go ahead and use that first aid kit because I am injured. And like I'm injured, I am lost. You oh, hey. To mark traverse territory. Show or hide the signals of your choice with your Xenoworks PDA. Now with surface support. Ooh. We have our first bacon. Now, if only we can make more. Kai, hi. Y'all don't know Kai Enma. You should give them a gander because they are a wonderful artist and they hang out with a lot of cool people. And they play some fun games. Like the time loop game. The stars, stars, uh, is it stars in time? Ah! What are you doing, penguin? Get out of my way. Stretch. Ugh! Ugh! Well, I hope your evening's going pretty fantastic. Like, you know, this really cool snake. Oh, you know a cool snake? Who is it? Yeah, probably, probably let me know. I could probably give them a gander too. <laughs> have you heard of them? I have heard of a lot of snakes. Let's check out this green glowy thing. It seems majestic. Ah. Uh. So one of uh, my coworkers uh, 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 makes desserts. Ow! What the fuck hit me? And I got a cheesecake from them. And I gotta tell you, it has really been hitting the spot. I'm like, I had like a nibble on it after uh, lunch because I'm an adult and I can eat cheesecake whenever the fuck I feel like it. And uh, it is still with me. I didn't eat an entire cheesecake. I, I portioned it out. They're very small slices. They're like, they're like five inch cheesecakes. They're very small. Um, but one of them is uh, 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 like banana cream and it's got like Nilla wafers on it. And it's uh, quite, quite good. All right, so this is just nothing. It's just, well, I mean, it's a signal or it's a, it's a thing that will lead me to more. Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. Dangerous weather approaching? Ah! They didn't tell me that dangerous weather was a cat. Welcome on by 
Milo. Playing Mortal Sin. I caught you a while. I saw you playing a little bit. How you been? If y'all don't know Knight Milo, uh, you should give them a gander because they are my they are my uh, VTuber brother, VTuber comrade. Uh, their 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 model was also done by the person who did mine, um, and they are a a night cat. They are pretty cool, if I do say so. How you been, Milo? Ha, ha, ha. I don't know how long you're probably you're going for a good few hours, so you know. You got a random run, that's no problem. Uh, leave a piss, take a water, I'll still be here. <laughs> Y'all don't know me, I am Drake Ormer, uh, Draconic Serpent, Flightless Dragon, uh, or simply the worm on the internet, playing games. Today's game is Subnautica Below Zero, the sequel to Subnautica. Um, if you've played it before, I ask that you please do not spoil or reno anything and don't backseat. I would I like discovering things on my own. Yes, food time. Get you that good, good eats. And hopefully you have some good stuff on the menu. I've been working my way through some leftover uh, Indian curry. So that's uh, that's gonna be my meals for like the next four or five eats. Um, we need food and water, so I need to cook. We'll turn these into wawa. And these into food food. Vital signs stabilizing. Good shit. Um, let's drop off those creature eggs. Um, we have a bacon, so that's cool. Um, okay, so we have those, um, on a survival, um, no, not what I'm looking for. I'm trying to see if there was anything about, um, Memos and miscellany, personal log, research, geological data, indigenous life forms. No, no. All right, I could have sworn I, I would have had something about that other alert we got. Um, ooh, the future of Xenoworks. Hey there, Xenoworkers. I know there's been a lots of rumors circulating. So I just want to clear some stuff up in the spirit of openness and transparency, which you know means a lot to us here at Xenoworks. First of all, no, Altera did not buy us. We're still Xenoworks. We're not going to move offices or start having some kind of hierarchical structure or even like making you show up on site or anything like that. Although you should for the snacks alone. We're still the scrappy, agile, research first startup you all signed up to. So what does this controlling stake stuff mean? Well, I guess the most direct way to put it means more, more equipment, more research, more risk, more experimentation, more of everything that makes us great. And most of all, more cash for you and your research. And yes, snacks. Lena will be in touch pretty soon about exchanging your old Xenogen Works PDAs for snazzy new Altera upgrades. And to help you get comfy with some really minor policy changes that are going to keep us running nice and smooth going forward. So yeah, congratulations everyone. We did this together. Now we're going to be able to do so much more. Cheers. All right, I I I, I think I think I I think I nailed the presumptive voice of of 
the startup owner. I, th I think I think I did pretty good on that. Uh oh, uh oh, chat. Storage is full. You know what that means. The flotilla begins. Ooh, I can make another bacon. Um, we're gonna make another bacon. So we have one in the pocket. But then. Actually, should I make floating? Should I make pipes? I mean, we haven't found a place that we need it yet. Well, shice. Well, we need the mobile vehicle bay eventually. Actually, we need a new battery now that I think about it, because this one is pretty much up. The so ribbon plant and copper ore. Uh, we need more ribbon plants, I see. Ribbon plant, ribbon plant, where are you to give me your ribbons? Rib, 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 ribbons, ribbon plant, ribbon plant, I need your ribbons to make batteries, batteries. Kinda of weird that we make batteries out of ribbons, but you know what? It's an alien world. We're just gonna roll with it. And we're also gonna roll with all of this lead, which I'm sure I'll need eventually. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Ugh, I have to swim like a peasant. Ugh. Oh, how dreadful. We have to swim again. Ugh. You know, we do have a bunch of titanium, so I might as well convert a bunch of it into a series of pipes and then see about exploring downward one of those deep areas. Who do we need to sacrifice for better equipment? I presume local flora and fauna, because that's usually been what we're sacrificing. All right. So now we got this. We're going to make a floating air pump. Let's make a bunch of pipes, at least 20 pipes. And let's make a water storage thing. A waterproof locker, I should say. Okay. We can store these in here. That in there. This, 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 that. Cannot put the battery in there. Noted. Um, we'll take the flare. And then we will go ahead and turn these fish into water bottles. Okay, now we need to deploy our water locker. Just leave that right there real quick. And let's go find a good spot to dive down with Operation Wow Pipe Bomb. Preferably away from sea monkeys, because we don't want them stealing our shit again. Ooh. Altera misplaces one kilometer capital ship Aurora. Oh, they're saying that they don't know. Delta Station. 
This is the place Lil mentioned in her message. Ooh. Well, I guess uh, we are we have a place to aim for now. Oxygen. Just oxygen. <laughs> That was, uh, 400 meters out? Alright, that's not too bad. Seems like that might be worth a place to do Operation Wow Pipe. But maybe we'll find another place that looks worth, uh, diving. What the fuck? What are you? They're like fishy iguanas. Crypto... Cryptosuchus? Oh, they are vicious. Ooh, what are you? Featherfish? You look pretty. I'm gonna grab one of you. Alright, looks like we found kind of a... Kind of a, found a volcanic-ish region, it looks like. All these spires are anything to go by. Some pretty big roars going on out there. Alright, that isn't anything. Noted. Okay. Ooh, sea truck. Okay. Got a piece of a new piece of a new vehicle. Barnacles. Okay. Um, we'll leave the bacon there. Ooh, scan the floodlight. Take some disinfected water. Ooh, trash can. Gonna love the f trash can. Uh, gotta love being able to dispose of things. Coffee vending machine? Oh, that's very important. <sighs> got the got my coffee right here. I I agree. This is a recorded message. If you can hear this, you're trespassing. If you know it's good for you, you'll get the hell out. Get the hell out of here. All right. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and get rid of that. Well, no. Ooh. Aha! Above ground rocks. Ghosty. That's a very obvious place to go to. Can I get? Nope. Can't get like a seed or anything. So it doesn't look like I'll be able to grow any of that myself. Ooh, light stick. Honeycomb fungus. I don't like that name. I'm gonna be honest. I don't want my fungus to be described as honeycomb because I don't like the implication. Like when I think of fungus, like the stuff that would goop out of a honeycomb fungus just doesn't sound appealing to me. Horseshoe scrub. All right. No reason to insult it like that. Sheesh. Okay, we need the sulfur. That's good to grab. I think we only need one, but we'll grab an extra just in case. What are you? Hmm. I saw something peeking out of them. Uh, water's over there. I saw an item. 
But I can't get to it. I think I'm gonna have to drop down on it. So we're gonna have to backtrack a bit and get further up. Ooh. That's crystalline sulfur. Some geothermal power. That's fine. That's fine. Good stuff. Certainly wonder what those. I'll probably need it. What the fuck? Stop right there, Altera. You're out of bounds. I'm not with Altera. What the fuck? Then your position is doubly precarious. What do you mean? If you're telling the truth, you're out of your mind. If you're lying, there'll be hell to pay. Wait! Well, she's got a hell of a mech. Stay off my land. Ah, shit. She sees Stedden. Where'd you go? The woman in the exosuit has been traced as far as my technology will allow. It would appear I'm far less alone on this planet than I had anticipated. Interesting. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Pilot, last known position. Yeah, uh, they've got a they got a pretty sick, nasty. Um, I don't think it's a cyclops. It's the the cyclops I thought was the submarine. Ooh. Gone fishing. Okay, this time the birds have really done it. I don't know what they've been eating, but it's corrosive when it comes out the other end. I'm short an element to fabricate the right cable. I remember seeing someone I did that dive to the old ship. I'm gonna go out there and see if I can get some more. That should fix it. Maintenance status in progress. Satellite surveillance active. Two active human life forms detected. Unauthorized habitat construction and vehicular activity detected. Recommendation. Observe and prepare for possible intervention. Hmm. Does that mean there's one other person or is it her and I? Prawn suit. Yep. You're right. But it looked like she had like a... Like a leviathan tooth or something as one of the arms... <gasps> flap flaps! Flap flaps! Come to me, flap flaps! I must scan you! Ow. I must break my leg, but also scan you! Flap flaps! Damn it! Part of a crab claw? Uh, eh. I don't know, it kind of looked like a giant tooth at a quick glance. Multi-purpose room. Fuck! I need the flap flaps to stand still. All right, we'll go in there a second. Oh, come on. Stop flying away from me. I mean, it's a good thing that progress is preserved, but it's still annoying. All right, we need to warm up. I won't tell me. Cushy setup. Must belong to one of those higher uppers. Emmanuel Desjardins. Good morning, Frostpack. Just a quick update to inform you of some key achievements and priority shifts we need you all to get behind. The Spy Penguin Project was a resounding success. Please join me in congratulating Samantha IU, who is now reassigned to Outpost Zero, helping us dream of future initiatives. Congratulations are also in order for Daniel Valenti and her team at Omega Lab. The closing of Phi Robotics means important funds can be redirected to their Kara bacteria study. Uh -oh. which has important 
positive implications for the life sciences. You're all doing an exceptional job, and I don't want to promise anything, but HQ has been taking notice. Keep up the good work, and I think we can start discussing bonuses soon. David? Sam really got under management's skin. I didn't know she had it in her. Mm. All right, so David. Okay. You'll be happy to know the Frost Pack is making excellent progress. I must say, my management style appears to be uniquely well suited to isolated planets. I miss you, of course, but I wonder if you feel it too. As great as we are together, we're almost better apart. Just look at how well Prosperina did in her last show. I'm sorry I couldn't be there to see it, but I'm sure if I'd been around, I'd only have made her nervous. Once this mission is over, I'll come home for a few good months. And then, what do you think if we look at reorganizing our expectations to facilitate longer-term separation success? What the fuck is I really that? I think this could be a great model for us going forward, romantically and otherwise. Don't forget, I love you from the depths of my heart. Keep on succeeding in your projects. You know there's nothing I find more attractive. What the fuck kind of text me? <laughs> that is just fucking weird. We're so successful together, but even more successful apart. I think we should explore this. So you want to divorce? I... Uh... Cor corpo corpo brain poison be strong on this this person Ooh. scanner room all right we're getting that pretty early PDA data. we don't even have the blueprint for the builder do we or did we get it repair tool no 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 i think we have to build a repair tool and then we'll get the blueprint for it Ooh. Insulated storage receptacle for beverages. Do I need that? No. I wonder if it gives me like um more water. Ah, builder. There it is. All right, what do we got in here? Blueprint synthesized. Ooh, a jukebox. Jukebox hero. Got stars in its eyes. It's a jukebox hero. For the last time, I'm not cheating. Then what's your theory? What's going on? If you ask me, Zeta's been blinking a lot. I think it's a tell. He does have a point there. It's allergies. Allergies? Oh, is something in bloom in this frozen sector? Thermal lilies, and if you gang up on me, I swear you're all fired. <laughs> you're not even my boss. Oh, you're all so gullible. You're fighting each other. Meanwhile, look at Parvin. <laughs> just look at him. What am I doing? I'm not doing anything. Let's just take this to a vote. All those who think Zeta's allergies are a bad case of alienitis, say intruder. Intruder. Uh, intruder. Intruder. Danny? Oh, I'm just an observer here. I'm going to use my pass. Is there some kind of scientist conspiracy going on here? Zeta, Sam, Danielle, you three are suddenly very aligned. Or, like I said, Parvin is cheating. I'm starting to wish I was cheating. Damn. Jenny, you wouldn't believe the adventure I'm having. It's just like when we were kids and we used to play underwater city. Only sea monsters aren't pretend and I don't need to hide behind you when one swims by. Because I'm safe in my sea truck safe and very very brave please tell dad for me <laughs> so much for the money. please tell dad by the way to be honest i wasn't sure if it was a gag gift at first personal grooming is something of a challenge here and as you know i'm a pretty low maintenance guy to begin with but you'd be surprised how handy mustache wax is in an emergency there have been some close scrapes for a while there someone was sabotaging my truck and i thought i was seeing things but my friend Sam helped me sort it out. Although, 
She's had some troubles of her own lately. To be honest, I get a little worried out here sometimes. But I guess that's normal under the circumstances. Ah. Oh, I expect a little rest, fucking missed right? it again. I should be happy. I have great friends and a good paycheck. Anyway, love you, Jenny and Dad. Please find a way to tell him that he won't find embarrassing. And don't worry. I'm looking for the perfect fish to bring back as a gift. Your favorite. <laughs> Ish. All right, what was that other data log we got? Communications tower maintenance log. Another day, another slight by the winged furies. As usual, I got an interference alert. As usual, I went out to see what the problem was. As usual, it was frozen stalagmites of feathered bird excrement. <laughs> I fear the career impact of saying this officially. If you can even call what I have a career. But I could swear they're targeting me personally. The week I was out with the flu, I came back to find the tower spotless. Parvin laughed at me when I asked him how he cleaned it. Silly me. As if Parvin would ever clean anything. There's nothing left for me to do but quit. But I know that's what the birds want me to do. Oh, and I got the tower up and running. Maintenance complete. Damn. Uh, sounds like Jeremiah is having a bit of the... Bit of a... Bit of a bird situation. Maybe you shouldn't have angered the birds. All right. See if I can drop down, breaking my ankles. Did I miss it again? Son of a bugger. I need to be a little bit more left. God's below and ever burning. Let's warm our hands up by the halogen lights. Nice of the game to have a little thermal entity to get ourselves nice and toasty by. Oh, I should maybe pin our... Man, we are, we're getting a lot of blueprints really fast and early in this game. I'm not sure what that says about the longevity. All right, so we're going to need a CPU and an advanced wiring kit. Nope, just a normal wiring kit. We have not found a source of gold yet, so that is a problem. Um, we do have the brain coral, though. So really all we need is the gold. Um, have are any of the rocks that we found able to Galena, lead and titanium, titanium and copper, silver and titanium. All right, so we just we just need to find a new kind of rock. Noted. Um, we are going to hide this one. Uh, need to get all clear out all these logs. I need you to go away, please. Let's see, there was one more. Oh, no, we already heard that one. Let's see, Manuel. Human resources and communications liaison. I see. Okay. Now let's drop down and properly get that damn supply cache. So up here, and then to the left, all right, I think this should line us up with it, nope, more to the left. All right, all right, so down... Ah, what am I stuck on? You can't stop me, invisible wall! There it is. There's that supply. Ow. Ow. 
Ooh, Calvarite? Is this going to be gold? I bet this is gold. Ooh, a battery. Chance of gold! There's gold in these rocks! Perfect. Perfect. Inventory full. Um, we will chug some water. We'll eat a nutrient block. Eh, it's just titanium. Ooh. What is this? All right, we need to make room for all this gold. Um, you know, it turns out I made a mistake of bringing all these dang pipes. I think what I'll do is we will drop um, titanium because that's our most easily obtainable resource. I'd rather grab whatever gold I can find in here first. Not sure what's up with this beacon-esque thing. All right, we have got a good amount of gold. Interesting. How do I get down here? All right, so there is like an official entrance. And it is down here. Take a dip in the hot springs. I don't believe you. I think that's like sulfuric acid or something. Okay, so it's like behind the camp. Take some stairs down. And that looks like there's just a whole bunch of potential gold ore. All right, now let's find... Yeah, crystalline sulfur. Yeah, that's that's not a bait. Also, that would smell awful because sulfur has like is like rotten eggs. <gasps> flat, flat. No, get back here. Yes, we have scanned the flat, flat. Um, can I not crouch? Options, gameplay, keyboard. Sprint. No. Why is there... <clears throat> That's annoying. I don't like that. That's frustrating gameplay to do that to me. Just rude is what it is. Okay, so let's make a trip back to home base. So I can drop off all the pipes. And then we can... Uh, craft. We can maybe build our habitat builder. Looks like I was a little bit, uh, jumping the gun on operation. Wow. I, wow. I, um, so cool. I wonder what happens if I... Mm. That music is always a treat. It's so ethereal. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I probably need that.
<sighs> Ooh. I should have guessed Altera would find a way to clip Sam's wings. Like I knew they'd do to mine once they took over Xenoworks. I tried to warn her. She was stubborn. Like me. Ever since I was a kid, I always wanted to be so different from her. Scrappier. Faster. Less... play by the rules. But Sam didn't tolerate Altera's corporate red tape any more than I did. She just... tried to change it from the inside. I think in the end, we always wanted similar things. Oof. All right, so we have the repair tool. I need... S oh, we're gated by silver. What an embarrassing thing to keep us... Uh, holding us back from our habitat builder. Uh... -huh. Let's see. Um, let's store some of this stuff. Oh, we have the silver. Never mind. Lol, JK. Yes, we have the Habitat Builder! Oh, fuck yeah. Oh, fuck yeah, might. Okay, um... Ooh, what a cool drawing. So how is the pangling a spy? Do they attach something in it? What was that woman's problem? The one in the exosuit? Like I need to say which woman. And what the hell is she doing on this planet? It isn't exactly a happening vacation spot. She knew their terrain well enough to make a dramatic entrance by jumping off a sheer cliff. So I guess she's been here a while. But how long has she been following me? She said to keep away from her or off her land. What in this frozen slush bog could she be protecting? Unless she's camped out somewhere. She's definitely heard of Altera though. Did she meet Sam? Hmm. The scanner room is a pretty good thing to get. I'll need some solar panels for it. I also would want a battery charger. And a fabricator. Adding emergency shelter blueprints to your data bank. Ooh, what's the emergency shelter? Uh, I don't see the emergency shelter. Did I miss it? Emergency shelter, emergency shelter. I don't see emergency shelter on here. Actually, instead of solar panels, we could go with the bioreactor. Uh, oh, Aram, I am afraid you're going out into the void. I hope you have your proper exosuit and a habitat builder. It might take you a while to get back. Uh, bioreactor might actually be better. We still need silver. We need more silver. The builder tool. You can construct sea bases from raw materials. Advising against exploring a frozen water continent without a base. No bed, no storage, no place to put a fabricator module. No fun. You're right, PDA. No fun. Damn, I've been countered. <laughs> Welcome on by. I hope you're having a good evening. Ooh, we also need to get a table coral sample. Now that I remember things. Um, we'll also need to make a hatch. Right. So if I use... Yeah, I want silver ore. Searching. 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 
If it rains in three to five business days, just you wait. <laughs> Uh, I don't know how good this thing is. It's not really finding anything. Seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, yeah. I'm not sure this little thing is all that great. Maybe I'm using it wrong. Oh, I need to look for Argonite outcrops instead of raw metals. Still does not seem to be a very effective tool. I'm gonna be honest. I don't know if it just has like a really low range. Almost seems better to just kind of muck around myself. But like... Elena... Argonite. Something to scan. Radiant sieve curl. Interesting. I don't know. I kind of rather. I, I'm probably going to dump that tool. I don't like it. And especially once I get the scanner room, it's kind of rendered redundant. Right, we're going to need a lot of silver, probably. We also need to keep our eye out for some table coral. So we're gonna need that for the um, electronics. I should have picked up more when I last saw it. The ores in this one are kind of much more specialized. I'm not sure how much I like that. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Because in the first game, like, your primary ores you were coming across would have, like, three different things they could be. It could be, like, copper, it could be titanium, it could be, you know, so, like, there, there was much more variety. And the fact that we're running across all these ores so early, like, last time, we mostly ran across just... Uh, uh, one stone, and then a second one was kind of rarer that you could run into, but you kind of had to start ranging pretty far before you're running into other stones. And coupled with the fact that we kind of got a lot of, um, it seems like a lot of, like, building stuff has already shown up. I'm wondering if this is going to be a shorter game. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Uh, where the fuck am I? I need to get away from you! Don't you chomp me! Don't you chomp me! They're so mean! They're so mean to me! I'm just a little guy! I'm just a little guy! What are these? Fumarole. 
Does this hurt? Ow! Yes, it does. Rusty! Ragged pitcher plant. Interesting. Hmm. I'm not seeing any table coral around here. 